Sup motherfuckers Black Ops 3 and Beckett We're gonna play some safeguard and go over 10 habits of happy couples as told by a psychiatrist Oh <laughs> Jesus I should have expected some stupid shit like that Alright Break it down for us. What's number one? Hold on. Let's see how long this game lasts first. Black Ops 3 is kind of good and kind of ass. I haven't decided yet. Holy shit. But anyways, I'll let you decide why I play. I'm going to play kind of slow so I can figure out my shit here. Alright, go ahead. What's number one, woman? Number one is go to bed at the same time. Ooh. I would... That is a good one, actually. Fucking laser ass gun. So why do you think that that's important? I don't know. Or do you think that? We don't do that. Oh, you don't think we do? I mean, we get. I feel like ninety percent of the time we do. We get into bed at the same time, but that doesn't. I yeah, I guess it's go to bed Jesus. together. Jesus. I guess it doesn't necessarily mean fall asleep at the same time. We are getting fucking railed. I jumped into the worst game of all time to do this and hang on a second. Before we go on, let me push out for my team here, for the squad. I think my team is just ass. Could be the case, plus lag. All right, so you think it's important or not? Yes, I do. Okay. I was thinking about falling asleep at the same time, and I was like, well, we don't do that, but if it means just physically going to bed at the same time. Yeah, I think we do that. I don't, I don't think you can, I don't think you can, like, fall asleep at the same time. I don't yeah. think that's a real thing. God, that's so good. All right. What's number two on our list? Number two, number two. Cultivate common interests. So what common interests do we share? What the fuck? Oh my god, it's behind me. I don't think it's previous to dating. I think it's like after you start dating, you figure out things that you like to do together. I think that's what it's saying. Okay, so you're saying make make time for things that you like to do together. Yes. God fucking damn it. And this figure is out what those things are. All right, so what do you think that we like to do together? I think we like to golf together. Golf, you think so? Mm-hmm. No, I knew that fucker was there. All right, I can agree with that. Or at least go to the driving range, because I don't know if what you do is called <laughs> golfing. All I right. think we like to go to the zoo together. That I might, agree with that. The that might zoo just be is, something that I like that you just go along with, but... Oh, well, I like to do those things. I like to golf. Well, I like to golf. Also, how's that guy not dead? Well, this is ass and a half. I'm going to have to step up, bigs. All right. I agree with that. Those are things that I like to do, but I think I like to do them just because you like to do them. I agree. What do you like to do that I like to do? That was golf. Oh, okay. All right. Golf yeah, that's, was that's your a good thing example. that you like to do that I just go along with and do, and then going to the zoo is my thing that you just go along with. I like. The, I actually like the zoo. Like I like animals. Oh God! No wonder we got railed. Turn the sound off. That's gonna drive me crazy. All right. So number three. Number three is walk hand in hand or side by side. You hate holding my hand, but we oh, do I walk hate next your hand. to each other. I think that's important. I don't see why you wouldn't do that if you're walking anywhere with your significant other you know I don't I don't like holding hands like I don't know why I don't like holding hands 
I think it's just the fucking goddamn this thing. I think it's more of a thing for me. I'm eating this bitch. Where I like to have my hands free. Does that make sense? Yeah, I understand, but I'm just saying I don't see why you wouldn't walk side by side or I'm hold hands or whatever if you were with your significant other. Like, that one doesn't really make sense to me because if you're with your significant other, boyfriend or girlfriend, why would you walk in front of or behind them? You know? Oh, you're saying like side by side. Okay. Okay, well, I get, no, I've, I've seen people do this to where they just kind of like lead the other pretty person rather than weird. walk beside them. I agree that it's weird. I just think that... I I'm just never. think that that's... That's a thing. I think it's a good thing. I, I tend to agree with that. Alright, it's so number four? Yep. Make trust and forgiveness Ooh. your default mode. Do you think that's the case with us? Yeah. Default mode. What, what do you... Let me read the explanation. If and when you have a disagreement or argument, and if they can't resolve it, happy couples default to trusting uh, and forgiving rather than distrusting and begrudging. Uh, okay, yeah. I, yeah, I, I feel like that's a pretty safe bet for us. Cause I feel like we don't... Like, if we do have a disagreement, we don't have it for very long. We'll normally compromise or... Just go with it. There's no... Oh, Jesus. Holding grudges, really. Or, like... Well, that's what I mean. Like, we don't really... If we do disagree on something, we can usually... Even if we strongly disagree on it, we can... One of us can either prove or prove our point... Or just let it go. Or just... Yeah. Okay, agree to to disagree. Yes. That's all there is to it. But that doesn't happen very often. No. Not really. Not in most cases. Usually one of us proves to the other person that they're right. <laughs> That's true. We usually don't... There's not a whole lot of... Like... Disagreement by the time we have a disagreement. What the fuck is that? I keep trying to shoot the damn drone thing. This isn't good. Alright, so... Number... What are we on? Five. Focus more on what your partner does right than what he or she does wrong. Uh, I could agree with that. I feel like that's fairly important because if you if you look at things in a negative light, like that's just going to be your default. Kind of like the thing where you just I don't know. You kind of look for those things, I guess, rather than find something good. I feel like you're good at so that. Like, I feel like I'm not so good at that. Like, you get annoyed with things, I guess. No, I like to make fun of you for things that you don't do. know or you don't do right. Oh, man, I suck. Or stuff like that. Yeah. So that's something I could work on. Number six. Hug each other as soon as you see each other after work. Well, in our circumstance, we hug each other as soon as we see each other. Yeah, I feel like we're, we're pretty good at that. Like, even even if we don't, like, I guess not see each other for a while, we're pretty good at, like, being affectionate. Mm-hmm. Even just, like, after class or something. Like, when we go to meet for lunch or whatever. Yeah. Like, I'll hug you or kiss you or whatever. Yeah. Number seven, I say like, I love you and have a good day every morning. Yeah, I feel like we do that. Yeah. Every day in the summer when we would go to work and text each other in the morning, it was always, that's always our last yeah. line to each other. Number eight, say good night every night regardless of how you feel. I always fall asleep. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't say... Oh, is that, are you talking about, like, through text, or are you talking about, like... Well, the picture is them, like, in person. Like, they're laying in bed together, so... Number 
We used to do that. Like when we were just laying here before we'd fall asleep, we'd say goodnight. Well, I think we still... I think we still do. I just don't think we... Oh, fuck me. I think we... I don't think we fall asleep without saying goodnight, though. Yeah. I wouldn't deliberately do it. Like... Because you're mad or something? Because I was mad or something like that. Yeah. Number nine. Do a weather check during the day. This means just, like, check up on your girlfriend or boyfriend throughout the day like hey how's your day going what's what's up you know that you, kind of thing what the hell why is everyone punching it wake up bitch all right well so you think shit but uh, i said no i'd say i'd say we do a pretty good job of that i wouldn't mm-hmm. say that like we're not blindsided when we see each other after work or after class or whatever and the other person is like either in a terrible mood or a really great mood. Normally, we talk to each other during the day and know what's going on. Yeah, that's true. You know, I don't th- there there aren't many surprises. Right. Throughout the day. And number ten, be proud to be seen with your partner. Do you think that's the case? Yeah. You're pretty quick on that one. What do you mean? I think... You think it's important? I wouldn't hide you if I went anywhere or do anything different. You know what I mean? What do you mean? Oh, you're... Okay, I see what... I think... I think I misunderstood it. Yeah, I think that we do a a decent job with that. I can't... I don't ever really think of it, like that way. Does that make sense? I don't ever think of it as... I can't see why you wouldn't feel that way. You know what I mean? Like yeah, dating, that's what I mean. Like, I wouldn't... If you're dating and it's a legitimate... I wouldn't... Yeah, I wouldn't be dating situation. you if that was... <laughs> yeah. I guess if you were, like, the side chick or whatever, then it would be different. <laughs> Healthy couples, not healthy... Ex- yeah, exactly. I'd say we've got yeah, 9 out of 10. What's the other one? What's 10? I told you the one I could work on. We just did 10. Oh, I thought that was 9. No, that okay. was 10. Yeah, I'd say we're pretty solid. I'm about to win this game for a squad. Oh god. Oh, you got that kill. About to sneak in the the enemy base though. About to get all these kills. Fuck you. That's alright, we won. How are the how are the rounds? You do multiple rounds? It's gonna take forever. All right, that's where we're ending. You don't know if we won or lost. Just so everyone's happy, we tied. I love everyone. Random video for you random COD lovers. That's the drop shot, babe. Winner, winner, chicken fucking dinner.
They are no match for us, babe. You know what I mean? Good. <laughs> What's the matter there, dude?